I'm proud to introduce the Cannabis Thought Leader series co-presented by Potbotics and Greenhouse Ventures. My name is Tyler Dautrick and I'm the co-founder of Greenhouse Ventures. In 2010, I was about to start my college career and my grandmother became very ill, had a laundry list of health problems that she was just getting prescribed prescription pill after prescription pill. She actually had a couple accidental overdose and she said to me one day, I wish I could just smoke marijuana and feel better. At that point, I had zero experience in cannabis. I 100% brought into the reefer madness stigma. So I went to school and I did four years of research papers, diving into the economic and the medical side of the cannabis industry. Luckily, during my time, Colorado and Washington State were just starting their both medical and recreational markets, so I really got to see it, it come up. And I truly don't think that we'll see another opportunity like this. I think you see a lot of entrepreneurs rushing to the space because we're in a quote unquote green rush. There's this talk of so much money being tossed around. That's not necessarily the case. It's a lot more sophisticated than it was when this industry was first starting to come online. There's serious investors in the space now who are looking to back serious teams. The people who had the most success in this industry today, I think are people who come from success outside of the cannabis industry and know how to implement that. You're essentially taking a black market industry and making it legal. There's tremendous opportunities all across the board there for every professional outside the industry almost to implement inside. So I think it's really about honing in on what you're already talented in and implementing that into the cannabis space. I'm most excited for Pennsylvania because of the medical cannabis research. And I think that's the biggest need in the cannabis industry right now. We've been saying this at Greenhouse for a long time, Pennsylvania and specifically Philadelphia has, we believe, the opportunity to be the research hub for the cannabis industry. One of the major criticisms that we still get is that it's not scientifically backed yet. What better way to do that than in a city that has three or four major medical institutions that are ready to do research? Bringing like-minded individuals to the space and especially thought leaders in the industry, I think it's creating an ecosystem. People who are really in this industry and really want to see this industry expand and grow, they know it's going to take an ecosystem. To engage with Greenhouse Ventures and learn more, you can check us out online at our website. It's greenhouse.ventures. Um, on there, we'll have a list of the services we provide, how we engage with companies that come through our accelerator semesters, and you'll also get to see all the industry experts all across different verticals of the industry that have volunteered time to work with entrepreneurs that come through our semester. You're talking about sophisticated individuals that are making a successful living in this industry who are looked upon as thought leaders that are volunteering their time to work with very early stage companies because they believe in the ecosystem and helping early stage companies grow a better industry.